Alongside Chris Johnston, as well as John Shannon, uh, not a massive splash, maybe dipping their, their foot a little bit into the free agency pool. And a real estate agent's best friend, no other than Dominic Moore, as he joins the Leafs. That's a 10th team for Moore. Second stint with the Maple Leafs. What do you make of this, Chris? Well, it's great cap management from the Leafs because their fourth line center position gets a little bit cheaper mm -hmm. uh, with Dominic Moore coming in at $1 million. We saw what Brian Boyle signed with over $2 million in New Jersey, and he filled that role for the Leafs at the end of last season. And in Dominic Moore, the Leafs get a penalty killer, so I'm going to give them some reliable bottom pair minutes. And, and as I say, for a team that has to worry about the cap here in the years ahead, I think this is a shrewd move and leaves them more money uh, to be involved elsewhere. And you know what? Speaking of penalty killers, I think there's a real expectation that Ron Hainsey is going to kill a lot of penalties for this hockey club too. We saw how well he played for the Pittsburgh Penguins. What a what a six, six or seven week experience for Hainsey when you consider yeah. it. Hadn't played in a playoff game, wins the Stanley Cup, and now signs as a free agent with the Maple Leafs. Two years for $6 million. Hainsey, the, the versatility of Hainsey is he can play both the left and the right side, and that's something, obviously, the way Mike Babcock likes to coach is going to be helpful for the Maple Leafs. The other thing is do not rule out, I'm not saying it's done, but done, do not rule out Roman Polak returning to the Maple Leafs at some point this summer. He suffered that nasty injury to end his season in that uh, playoff series against the Washington Capitals. All right, with more on the Leafs and their day of free agency, let's hear now from Sean McKenzie. As the day winds down here in Toronto, we have still not heard from Leafs general manager Lou Lamorello, which is interesting. We have heard from a lot of the other Canadian GMs who said they are done for the day. It's clear that that is not the case for Lou Lamorello. Does it mean they are still pursuing Patrick Marlowe? It very well could, but we don't know for sure. What we do know for sure, though, is the Leafs have made some depth moves today, adding Dominic Moore and Ron Hainsey, two moves that fill a void with Matt Hunwick leaving as well as Brian Boyle. They get their defenseman in Hainsey and they get their fourth line center in Dominic Moore. Now, the interesting thing when speaking to Hainsey and Moore, they made it clear that one of the biggest motivations for them to come to Toronto was just how good the Leafs were this past season and how close they they feel the Maple Leafs are to winning a Stanley Cup. 